Shall we begin the night's entertainment? It is going to be a fine eve! Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Boss Time! And let's play Bravely Second, the demo, against Geist the Bloody, or the Exorcist, or whatever. He's also got a couple Imperials with him, making this one of the most difficult boss fights in the demo. Well, the most difficult boss fight in the demo by quite a big margin in my book. So let's see what we can do. First things first. I don't really care about what weapon I have equipped on Nikolai, so I'm just going to switch him over to the wizard's rod for now there. And I might use the staff on someone else. Okay, so to start here, let's get two love powers going on the party, and I want to use two got your back on the party to boost everyone's physical defense. Because these guys hit for a lot of damage. Okay, let's have you default. Jan, why don't we have you examine the sniper there for now. Who I would like to kill first, if I could. And then for Magnolia, let's use Nothing Ventured to draw some aggro. But yeah, let's get everyone buffed up here. Definitely want to have an Astrologian for this fight. Now, from here, the fight will proceed in one of two ways, depending on what the sniper ends up doing there. The sniper is weak to water. And let's see, what do you do? Okay, sharpshooter. We got the sharpshooter version of the fight. Uh, let's see. Well, as you can see, when I'm trying to target one of them, I can't target the sharpshooter. That's basically like the jump command essentially we can't target them or damage them at all and they're gonna come back and hit us for a lot of damage but not this round because they're in negative bp so the next round is when they're going to attack so what i want to do because the fight is going this way i want to equip both stabs that i've got on uh, what, on you there and then I want to cast Cure and use the Mist Spellcraft there, which will make the spell happen at the end of the round on the entire party for the next three rounds. Since I know Sharpshooter is about to happen, I can prepare with that. But otherwise, let's see, with, with Jan there, yeah, we can't really do a whole lot there. Jan did take a bit of damage though, so I want to keep using Nothing Ventured to kind of draw some of the aggro if I can. So this is what the Exorcist can do. Uh, undo HP that makes him really dangerous there, where, well, like the description said, it reverts the target's HP to what it was in the previous round. So that can be a problem if I'm trying to heal up my party after taking a lot of damage because he can just undo that. Okay, so with you, I want to default. I think I want almost everyone to default except for Magnolia there. Hopefully, they won't go after Jan. You might have also seen that other ability that the Desert Blade used called Prey on Weak and that'll always target the character with the lowest HP. Now that sharpshooter there, that would deal a lot of damage if you did not have your physical buffs, your defaults, your uh, nothing ventured going there. So that's why I did everything the way I did. Okay, so with you, let's see. I want to get ready for the desert blade there. So I'm just thinking if I want him to use, let's see, a magnifying glass on them. I think we can do that. I'm just thinking if I want to heal a little bit for Jan there as well. Because I'm going to have Jan attack, so he's going to be wide open for damage there. Let's see. Okay, well first, let's equip our shield again. Because the power of the Cure Mist is based on whatever your mind stat was at the time you cast it even if you change your weapons later. But otherwise, yeah, we'll just leave this alone, mostly. Okay, so let's go 
Magnifying Glass on the Desert Blade. I'm hesitating to use Cure on Jan because Geist might see that and decide, hey, let's undo that. So I'll go for it, but I'm not entirely confident that is the right thing to do. Now, remember, Jan has, uh, what is it? The Serpentis rifle equipped there that is water elemental. So he should be able to kill the desert sniper there. Hopefully that'll all work out. Oh yeah, we'll get them for sure now with the crit. Very nice. And a multitask right on top. Okay, well, that didn't go as planned. Now, the problem here is that once someone dies, Geist can pretty much always, whenever you revive them, he can pretty much always go undo, 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 and make you dead again, because that's what your HP was in the last round. So, yeah, that really screws things up here, but at least everyone else is at good HP. So, let's see. What's our speed look like? Okay, your speed is pretty terrible. So, how about we do this? Why don't we go with a high potion on Jan? Hmm. Yeah, I might as well. Okay, you do that. Let's see. I'll have you default. And why don't you just go with the Phoenix down on Jan? And hopefully I can fix this. There we go. Yeah, sometimes the Swordmaster job class has that counter passive ability, but that doesn't always work like nothing ventured would. Okay, so we got all that going. Now that we've gotten you good to go, let's get our party fully buffed up again. Let's go... Hmm. I was thinking about only using one love power. Let me think. Let me get back to that. Let's go to Mystic Boom on you, because I'm going to want him to uh, deal some magic damage eventually. Then let's go at least one love power. And I'm thinking if I want to go with Got Your Back, because Jan lost all of his uh, defense buff there. Let's see, his defense is not that good in the first place, though, because he doesn't have a shield. So I think I'll just go with double double love power there. Default. And then probably nothing ventured or a default herself. I think I'll just go for default there, but I don't want her to take too much damage. So we'll go with that. And okay, let's see what Nikolai can do here. Okay, so what are you guys going to do? Hooray! He didn't uh, use that on Jan like he should have. So that's part of my plan here, using Cure Mist and, well, just healing in general. I like to heal multiple party members at once to create as many potential targets as possible for undo HP in the event that Geist will do something stupid, which he did. Hooray! Okay, so I need one more, uh, what is that? Yeah, one more BP for you there. So, how about we do this? We'll go half C's, or, no, that would put him in negative BP. Why don't you default for now? I'll use half C's in the next round. And then Magnolia, I think I'm just going to have her default. Instead of nothing ventured? Yeah, we'll go with that for now. And if I can get some counterattack damage, so much the better. Okay, so with you now, let's go uh, Thunder Hammer on the Desert Blade twice. That probably won't be enough to kill the guy. But let's see what else we can do. Okay, let's go, yeah, half seas with a high potion that will restore 250 HP to all allies, and that could really help out Magnolia there. I'm just thinking if I want her to join in, too. I don't think I actually need to. I think two Thunderhammers will be able to kill the guy, assuming Geist doesn't use undo HP on him. 
So let's just go with that. Hopefully Geist won't attack Magnolia either. Okay, that's fine. We can deal with that. Okay, we're good. We're good. We survived. Okay, so we get all that. Wow, look at that damage. <laughs> okay, the fight just became a lot easier. Okay, so then with Geist... Well, normally I don't have this much... Uh, BP with Magnolia there. Otherwise, I might have equipped redoubled effort. Okay, so... Let's see. To kill him, I think we have everything I need to do that. Yeah, let's just go all out right now. That is, if the frame rate will come back. Please come back. Please come back. I really don't want to have to re-record this. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's go Fire Hammer! Oh, I uh, almost forgot to equip my rods. So, yeah, let's definitely get that going. I should have done that before the the first uh, the thunder hammers that I did there. Whoops. But, I mean, it still got the job done anyway. Okay, so now let's go fire hammer since I can boost the damage a little bit. Uh, let's see. Geist is not weak to uh, anything. So I'm not really worried about that. Let's see. Let's go examine. And then three attacks. All of that put together should be enough to take him down. Uh, oh, okay. Darn, I lost 100 HP. Yeah, sometimes Geist can be pretty stupid with undue HP. All right, multitask. Very nice. Oh, a couple multitasks. How are we doing? We should be... Oh, now we'll definitely get the guy. Yeah! Got him! Woohoo! Well, I showed you guys the hard version of the fight when, uh, yeah, the sniper uses a sharpshooter there. The fight can go a lot easier if they don't. And I do want to show that after this, but let's get through here first. And for defeating Geist, we get... The Exorcist Asterisk, which includes that undo HP move that he's got. Unfortunately, we're so close to the end of the demo now. Yeah. <laughs> How delightful! What fine prey you turn out to be! <laughs> but you're gonna die now. This is most unfortunate. I am thoroughly out of strength. Well, yeah, that is true. We were all in negative BP. You're pretty close. But he's hurting too. This might be the best shot we've got. Off with his head! The party has only just begun, and already someone has come to crash? Hmm? Well, you see, I can't just sit by and let you run wild over my town. Oh, what are you doing here? Wait, isn't that Mr. DeRosa? Take pity on an old man. You don't want to make me look bad, right? So how about you just withdraw? How? He's in a basement. <sighs> what an inconvenience. Uh-huh. But fine. I will take my leave. Death shall come for you soon enough. Not. Yes. It comes for you all. And there is nothing you can do to stop it. <laughs> he's, got a, he's got the villain laugh down. I gotta give him credit for that. Phew, we would have been in a tight spot without you, Mr. DeRosa. But what are you doing here? <laughs> Some of my lovely, young, female students have come to me crying over a frightening intruder. Oh, yeah. It looks like I saved you right in the nick of time. Feel free to give me a thank you kiss, my sweet. Yes, surely you deserve one. Well, you, go on. <laughs> What, me? <laughs> well, there you go. 
I must say, despite his shameless words and actions, that mage in red seems to be a decent sort of man. No, not really. Oh, what a fright, though. Do you suppose that horrifying man really was a ghost? Well, that would be an oxymoron, being an exorcist. Maybe, yeah. Maybe no. You need me to hold your little hand, you? <laughs> That won't be necessary. I have Magnolia for that. Thank you very much. <laughs> Poor you. But, oh right, we're done with our business here. Looks like we probably got some items from the shops. Not that I really need them. Let's see what we got going on in the bestiary here. So now I should pretty much have everything. Except, like, every single entry here, which I'm going to do off-screen before the next episode. So I'm going to, like, kill enough enemies to completely fill out the best area, not just the enemies, or random enemies here. And what else do we got? Okay, we got Gargantua. I neglected to show that before there. What do we got? Well, yeah, that was an easy enough fight. It was pretty hard the first time I uh, played the demo, but we got him. Well, I don't know that we have a way of reducing their physical strength, do we? We don't have anything like debuffs or anything. We got physical buffs, but that's about it. Physical defense, I mean. But, yeah, holy cow, all those tax there that they could use at once once they defaulted there and we don't have anything to pierce default i'm afraid but at least we got geist out of the way well, maybe might be an assassin i suppose exercising a ghost would be might be considered a kind of assassination I wonder if you could exercise yourself. That's creepy. But in any case, yeah, now we have that ability with the exorcist job class, but I'm not really going to be making use of that. Why don't we get out of here then? We're done with our business here. And okay, so should still be nighttime. Although, oh yeah, that reminds me of something I, uh, I want to show you guys something, too, in a moment. Is something going on out here? Well, let's at least make it daytime. Holy cow! Let's see. After completing the hidden room dungeon, let me see what else we got. Can I show this here or no? Let's see. Yes, I can! Okay. Yeah, someone was saying, Itchy Bailey, once you go into the dungeon at night, you can go back in there in the day if you wanted to. We can still do that, right? Yeah, we can still do that. We're not, like, locked out or anything. So if you wanted to, you could handle it that way. Okay, and then let's see. What do we got over here? Oh, okay, yeah, sure. What do we got? Sure, why not? What are you talking about? A natural disaster? Like that sandstorm around in chime or something? Oh, ha <laughs> ha. Oh, okay. Whoa! Maybe they've already taken out in chime altogether. Hmm. Nuts. But, uh, okay. Well, it's not a quest or anything like that. But, uh, let me see if, uh... Let's see. Does Agnes have anything to say about that? Oh, no, no uh, of course not. Perish the thought! 
<laughs> Angry face. Hmm. Well, yeah, that too, I suppose. We don't actually really care about worrying you. Oh, well, I'll try. I mean, if I die, I can just undo it, and that would take care of the problem. But, uh, okay, so now what I want to do is I'm going to go back to my previous save file and show you the fight with Geist, but hopefully this time without the sharpshooter to overcome. Shall we begin the night's entertainment? It is going to be a fine eve. For boss time against Geist. Hopefully without the sharpshooter action, and that'll make this fight a lot easier. Okay, so the first round, I always do the same thing every time because I don't know whether they're going to use sharpshooter or not. So let's just go with a good examine on the sniper before killing them. And we'll go with that for now. And fast forward through all the buffs. Okay, very good. Thank you for not attacking Jam. Ooh, look at that damage. Really good counterattack. And what are you going to be up to? By the way, the sniper actually has pretty low speed. Otherwise. Okay, okay, we're good. I'm pretty sure we could kill the sniper. So how about we do this? Let's see, with you... Let's go with Cure on everyone, I think. Yeah, we'll just go... Oh! Oh, I forgot to remove the... What is it? The staff there. Well, I can equip this one. It's nearly as good. But yeah, get that on everyone. Jan, why don't you attack the sniper? I'm thinking if I want Magnolia to use Bushido here, or maybe attack the sniper if I need an extra hit to finish him off. Hmm. The thing is, I'm also getting a little light on HP. And also, you would be open to attack. So, how about... I think I'll still use it, though. Yeah, we'll go with that. Jan should be able to kill the sniper. But we'll see how many multitasks we get in the process. That can help a lot. Multitask? Yeah! Got him! All right. But yeah, uh, you might have noticed during all of those multitasks... Oh yeah, that guy's going back up to full. <laughs> we dealt a lot of damage. But yeah, you might have noticed after each one of those multitasks, Barrage procced again, further increasing the damage he was dealing there. Okay, so let's see. From here, I think I might just want to use another cure while I'm at it. Let's see. I could go... No, wait. I can't go on the offense yet because I don't have uh, Nikolai's buffs yet. So for now... Yeah, why don't we keep going with nothing ventured? I might want to get an examine in there, though. Let's see. Yeah, why don't we do that now? Since we're in pretty decent shape otherwise. But yeah, I got him back up to full after those huge counters there. Yeah, sometimes you get that passive counter every now and then. And sometimes guys just does something for the hell of it. Okay, so for Magnolia, hmm, I'm thinking if I want to get a little damage on these guys, so Geist might use Undo HP, but that guy could probably use Prey on Weak on Magnolia there too. Hmm. So how about we just default here instead? Maybe not draw as much aggro. Or maybe we will anyway. Okay, well, we got some damage in there at the very least anyway. Okay, so now let's get the party fully buffed up. Let's get a good love power. Let's see, another got your back. And two mystic boons on you. 
But then, let's see, your HP, yeah, he's gonna need some help to take that guy down. So, oh, yeah, and I need to equip my rods. Especially now. Let's see, you're at full HP, so they probably shouldn't be able to kill you. Then go Thunder Hammer on the Desert Blade there. And then, yeah, let's just go all out on the Desert Blade. Hmm, I'm thinking if I might want to use a High Potion. That might not be a bad idea. How about we do that? And that way, if she dies, I won't be wasting a High Potion and a BP while I'm at it. Okay, that should be good. But yeah, let's get fully buffed up first. Okay, that should be good. Come on. Okay, that helps. Yes! Okay, we survived. We're good. Got a little... Wow, look at that damage. Holy cow. Now we should easily be able to win the fight. Assuming he doesn't kill Jan. Oh, and I need to get my... Uh, my uh, uh, examine in on the guy. So how about, um, did I no. get all the BP going? Fire hammer! Okay, get that going. And then almost forgot about the examine again. We should be able to take him down with this, unless he uses undo HP on himself, which he probably will. Not well, at least we got a crit. Two crits. We can still kill the guy. <laughs> Woohoo! Double crit for the win. Triple crit while we're at it. Holy cow. That worked out better than I could have possibly imagined. <laughs> but all right, we got him. That's the easy way to do the fight if you don't get sharpshooter so i don't have to default over and over and over again until we can uh, wait for them to be done sharpshooting or aiming or whatever they're doing in the time that uh you know while they're in negative bp but can we defeat that monster causing the natural disaster Find out next time on the finale of Let's Play Bravely Second, the demo. This is Ichi Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.